The Beast has arrived. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar. Emotionless, heartless, and hell-bent on absolute destruction. That, my friends, is the Beast Incarnate, Brock Lesnar. I've been calling Brock Lesnar's matches since he debuted here at WWE. And I have never been as frightened as I am when Brock Lesnar enters an arena. Brock Lesnar doesn't respect anyone in WWE or walking the planet Earth. Nor should he have to. You're looking at the Beast Incarnate. I can honestly say today that that man, Brock Lesnar, has meant more to my career than anybody else. Because the night he delivered an F5, Byron Saxton had to go to the announce table and do solo commentary. And it was on that night where the world realized how good I really was. Slayer, the architect, undeniably one of the best superstars WWE has seen this generation. And his opponent from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins looks like he's more than ready for this matchup here tonight. You have to respect the determination and the ferocity he brings with him to the ring. Seth Rollins didn't topple a king and slay a beast by taking them lightly or showing mercy. Seth always fights to win. It's taken blood, sweat, and tears for Rollins to get to where he is today. I don't think he's about to start going easy on his opponents or himself anytime soon. The King Slayer set for action. So much has transpired between Seth Rollins and Brock Lesnar for years. Lesnar had a stranglehold on the Universal Championship until his match with Rollins at WrestleMania. We knew it would come down to this, the aftermath. Tonight, Brock Lesnar is looking to avenge his loss to Rollins at WrestleMania. Some say that puts the Beast Slayer behind the eight ball. Seth Rollins disagrees and has a ton of steam heading into this match. Boom, kick! Oh, kick right to the gut. Oh, the reversal by Brock Lesnar. German suplex! Back in the ring again. Oh, and a scoop slam! Seth Rollins faltering just a bit. A little too early to worry. Yeah, but he's not breathing heavy yet. Oh, and a belly suplex! Brock Lesnar's the beast. He's the conqueror. But Brock must be aware of Seth Rollins' speed and quickness and Seth's ability to endure tremendous punishment and keep fighting. Seth Rollins is very familiar with Suplex City and its confines. Lesnar must prevent Rollins from utilizing his ability to strike from the ground and the air. That could keep Lesnar off balance all night. Seth Rollins knows he can't stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Beast. The Beast knows Rollins can't stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with him. Lesnar only has to defend against any of Seth's desperate low tactics. Oh, that hurt. 
knee to the spine. Oh, the reversal by Brock Lesnar. Belly to belly suplex. Seth Rollins in a very difficult spot here. He's not looking great, but never count him out. Straight punch. Setting up. Boom. Nice. Larian. Oh, kick right to the gut. Wicked body shot. And a suplex. Lost in the corner right now. from behind. Brock Lesnar, perhaps setting up for a trifecta of Germans here. And Corey, you know what this means. And all expenses paid trip. German after German by Brock. Brace for impact, here it comes. The Beast incarnate with a five. But can they turn that into a win? Oh, no. There's the pin. An incredible win for Brock Lesnar. Take a look back at the conqueror laying waste to his opponent. The Beast Incarnate was all...